Good day, my lovely pupils. You're welcome once again to today's class. I am teacher Omasa, your civic education teacher. Before we commence with the lesson, let us pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Our Father, we thank you for today. We commit today's learning into your hands. Lord, we ask that you take charge. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Our topic for civic education today is loyalty. Loyalty. Loyalty is the quality of showing strong commitment and support to someone, an institution, or a nation. We all, in one way or the other, exhibit the character of loyalty. Loyalty, once more, I take it again, is the quality of showing strong commitment and support to someone, an institution, or a nation. Commitment means when you do not give up on someone, you stand by the person to achieve, to help the person to achieve his or her goals. Support, you dare to encourage the person, institution, or a nation. Now, let's look at a group of people we are to show loyalty to. One, family. You are to show loyalty to your family. That is, members of your family, your parents, your siblings. You show them loyalty by supporting them helping them, encouraging them. Number two, church. You have to show loyalty to your church, your pastor, your Sunday school teacher, your choir master or mistress. These are members of the church. You have to show loyalty to them. Number three, school. Your school, the school you attend. You have to be loyal to your school. The teacher, prefect, supervisor, you have to be loyal to them. Number four, your country. Our country, Nigeria, you have to be loyal to your country by showing respect to the national symbols and the leaders in your country. Now, we're going to look at evidence of loyalty. We've just learned the group of people we are to show loyalty to. So let's look at how we can express the loyalty to this group of people. Evidence of loyalty. Evidence of loyalty are the things people say and do to show that they are loyal. Evidence of loyalty are the things people say and do to show that they are loyal. Family. How do you show your how do you show loyalty to your family? Going on errands when your parents ask you to do such. Helping them. Helping your father to wash his car. Mom, mommy to do the house shows. Church. Attending Sunday school. When you go to church, you're always present. Three, school, your teachers, obeying the instructions of your teachers and the prefect of the class. Country, respecting the national anthem and other national symbols. Now, we have other examples here of how to show loyalty, which means the same thing as evidence of loyalty. Obedience. We have to be obedient to our parents, our elders, and our leaders. Obey their instructions. Number two, respect for nation and national symbol. You respect your nation. How do you respect your nation? Don't speak ill about your nation. Say good things about your nation. And also respect the national symbols. 
stand erect when the national anthem is being sung, if the flag is in, a, in the school or in an office, once it's started, you replace it with a new one. That's a way of respecting your nation and national symbols. Then number three, standing by someone. You stand by someone. It can be your teacher, it can be your parents, it can be your prefect. Stand by your teacher in class. How do you stand by your teacher in class? Obey the instructions your teachers give to you. How do you stand by your leaders? Speaking good about your leaders is also a way of standing by, your, by someone. Then number four, rendering assistance and making personal sacrifice. Assistance means to help. You are in the classroom. Madam, sir, what can I do for you? Can I help you to arrange your books on your table? You are rendering assistance. Making personal sacrifice. You can also make personal sacrifice to your classmates. Your classmate doesn't have a pencil or forgot to bring the ruler to school. You have two. You can give your classmate one. By doing that, you are rendering personal sacrifice. All these things you've done is an act or an act of loyalty. You see? One way or the other, unknowingly and knowing, knowingly to us, we engage in the act of loyalty, which is a good act. And we should keep on doing it. So with this, we've come to the end of the lesson on loyalty, which is the quality of showing strong commitment and support to someone, an institution, or nation. Groups of persons we can show loyalty to, family, church, school, and country. And then evidence of loyalty, the things you do to show that you're loyal, which we've looked at. Obedience, respect for the nation and national symbol, standing by someone, rendering assistance, and making personal sacrifice. Now, before we finally end the class, make sure you copy your notes neatly and do your homework correctly. To so meet again next class, Stay blessed and bye for now. Bye.